The Pan-Caribbean Partnership Against HIV and AIDS, PANCAP, was established on February 14, 2001 by CARICOM heads of governments in response to the spread of HIV which threatened the development of the region. This regional mechanism, currently comprising over 65 members, has been the umbrella for the provision of regional goods and services to various stakeholders including people living with HIV. PANCAP's membership includes CARICOM and other member states from across the English, Dutch and French-speaking Caribbean, regional organizations and institutions, regional civil society organizations, bilateral and multilateral agencies, and contributing donor partners of the Caribbean. PANCAP has been hailed as an international best practice by the Joint United Nations Programme on HIV and AIDS, UNAIDS. PANCAP provides a structured and unified approach to the Caribbean's response to the HIV epidemic, coordinates the response through the Caribbean Regional Strategic Framework on HIV and AIDS to maximize efficient use of resources and increase impact, mobilizes resources and build the capacity of partners. PANCAP provides a voice to the community and civil society, including people living with HIV and key population groups such as men who have sex with men, sex workers, people who use drugs, migrants and youth at the highest level of decision making. PANCAP focuses on policy coordination in relation to human rights, advocacy, stigma and discrimination reduction, civil society, harmonization of donors and technical agencies in HIV. Over the last 23 years, PANCAP has supported a number of CSOs in their HIV responses through institutional capacity building and the implementation of prevention programs. The partnership that CVC has had with PANCAP has been a long-standing partnership um, that evolved out of a recognition of the need for civil society to be actively engaged in the, in the policy discussion and at the level of the leadership of the regional response. So our partnership goes beyond a single project. Our partnership is about how PANCAP has facilitated the provision of spaces for key and vulnerable population in the governmental conversation, in the intergovernmental conversations that have been occurring across the region. It has just been a significant joy for Jamaica Aid Support for Life to be working with the Pan-Caribbean Partnership against HIV and AIDS since its inception. JASO was there from day one as a signature to the partnership. And PANCAP has embodied that partnership over the years. We continue to partner with them. They continue to partner with us. Uh, just going annually to the National AIDS Program Managers meeting, seeing what's happening across the Caribbean, learning from other countries, learning from other program managers, and sharing our own insights into how we manage our HIV program has really just helped to, to, to push our work in the right direction. CVC and PANCAP have together over the last three cycles of Global Fund Grant collaborated in the implementation of those global fund projects. We have also collaborated in other um, opportunities with UNA, with PAHO, to ensure that key and vulnerable population uh, considerations are brought to bear on the policy and program decisions that are being made and recommended to the leaders, particularly the health leaders of the Caribbean. So right now, as a civil society organization, we enjoy the, 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 the knowledge share fairs that they do, where we are able to not just share our work, but to look at other deep, in-depth parts of programs to see how we can always make our programs fit and ready for the clients that we serve. A significant component of this relationship between ourselves and PANCAP has been the top-down, bottom-up model of ad advocacy and um, program thinking that has been brought to bear on the work with PANCAP um, taking leadership to engage with the ministers and the various heads of government while CVC along with other civil society partners provide the underground bottom information that informs some of those conversations that are being held. Additionally, we have been very happy to have the partnership with, with um, PANCAP in which we collaborate around training and capacity building uh, for our key and vulnerable population, our civil society groups across the Caribbean. So all in all, I think the, the, the relationship has been extremely positive, extremely fruitful over the years. And like any other relationships, they do sometimes have their challenges, but I think overall we have had 
very, very positive experiences collaborating with PANCAP on all the activities and the interventions that we have engaged with them on. Civil society organizations, not just in Jamaica, but across the region, get a, a platform to be a part of the whole mechanism with governments and other national systems to just make sure that the voices of the communities are heard and they are incorporated in how programs are managed and run and implemented across the region. And we are just super proud of that partnership. We look forward to continued success in the partnership and engagement and just that consistent learning from each other that has made the Caribbean, you know, the, 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 the place that it is in terms of how we are able to serve not just people living with HIV, but those persons who are most affected and key and vulnerable populations and so we will continue to do our part in the partnership by not just being present but sharing as well and giving of our own expertise as we continue to benefit from the partnership with PANCAP. Two of the most recent examples in how PANCAP has helped and partnered with us is through the recent South to South Learning Exchange where countries from across the region were able to come to Jamaica and explore some of our program offerings. Another example is the PREP partnership, where we as JASL were able to take our implementation practices around pre-exposure prophylaxis to others in the region. These are two solid examples of how PANCAP's partnership with civil society agencies have been a big part of their modality. PANCAP continues to play a leading role in the continued progress being made in the fight against HIV and AIDS in the Caribbean. Our mission at PANCAP will be to continue to support the regional HIV response through the shaping of people-centered policies, supporting, engaging, and enabling community leadership and community-led responses to achieve an AIDS-free Caribbean. Music